what's up mga hot dates me Ate Maria at welcome sa Hot Dinos where learning is the name of the game. So kung bago ka pa lamang sa aming YouTube channel, i-click mo na ang subscribe, like and share button para bigyan tayo ka sa aming mga videos. So samahan natin si Super K sa panibagong araw at panibagong lesson na ating matututunan dito sa Hot Dinos at ang bagong lesson natin for today is classification of soil. So before we start, meron tayong trivia for today. So yan, on Mars, sunsets are blue. Wow. Grabe, gusto ko makita yun. <laughs> Charot. The sunsets we know are typically mellow yellow or fiery pink. So, sa atin dito, so per bet na bet ko yung sunsets and sunrise. So, imagine kung, kung meron din sa earth natin na sunsets katulad ng summers na color blue. Ano kayong itsura nun? So, but if we live on Mars, we'd witness blue sunset as seen in a series of images snapped by NASA's Curiosity rover in 2015. So, yung mga taga-NASA talaga, no? nauna talaga sila sa mga ganito. So, sa Mars, di ba, pinagtetest siya ng mga planet, ah, ng mga taga-NASA if we can live in Mars. And, and super fascinating and super amazing naman talaga if makikita natin yung blue sunsets. So, they have a snap of it in NASA's Curiosity Rover in 2015. So, dito na tayo sa ating lesson proper, classification of soil. There are so many ways to cla of classifying soil. The most common is according to composition. So, syempre, there are different ways to know someone's or something's composition. So, no, nakadependent talaga sa composition yung mga properties, itsura, shape, and iba't iba pang mga a bagay na pwede nating makita sa isang soil or sa isang bagay. So, alamin natin kung ano-ano yan. So, next. So, yan. Mimop. <laughs> They are, one, clay soil. is fine grain soil. So, yan. Huwag na natin anuhin. is fine grain soil produced by chemical weathering of the minerals that can be hard when wet. So, clay soil. It's clay. So, with, sa pottery yata to, so kasi syempre kapag minerals na nagiging hard pag basa. So, I think that's clay soil. It's used for clay pot making. Yeah. Check, correct me if I'm wrong. Sandy soil is the loose material produced through chemical weathering. So, sandy soil is produced in chemical weathering. So, clay soil is also produced in, produced by chemical weathering. So, it is, uh, Minerals that is hard when wet. So, this is the sandy soil, loose material. Loam soil is mixture of clay and slit. Humus soil is composed of decayed plants and animals containing, containing nitrogen and other plant minerals. So, kanina, do sa ating all about soil, nalaman natin yan, di ba, nasa soil. Unang-una siya sa soil horizon. So, doon nakalagay yung mga... Doon natin tinatanim yung plant. So, syempre, need din naman natin ng pataba or need din naman natin ng mga decayed uh, animals to, to, to be more, uh, parang maging healthy yung isang soil. So, that's number four, humus. Ang nating loam is composed of clay and slit. So, yan. Another way of classifying would be world classification. World classification. This is according to the places in the world where they are found. So, di ba kanina, composition, ngayon naman is world classification. So, this is the clay soil. This is the sandy soil. This is the loam soil. This is the humus. So, medyo mabilis pala yung lesson natin. So, gawin, so mag, ano muna tayo, mag-backread muna tayo. Wow, backread. So, dito, we have many ways to classify the soil according to composition. So, pag sinabi natin composition, anong itsura niya, gano'n ba siya kalaki, gano'n ba siya ka um, healthy, ano yung itsura niya, physical properties, ganyan. So, clay soil is fine grain soil produced by chemical weathering and sandy soil is also produced in chemical weathering. So, materials, clay soil is the materials that can be hard when wet and sandy soil is the loose material produced through chemical weathering. So, sa loam soil naman is a mixture of clay and slit. Humus soil is composed of decayed plants and animals containing nitrogen and other plant materials. So, another way of classifying soil is the class is the according to the places in the world where they are found. 
So, yan. This is the clay soil. Ayan. This is the sandy soil. Marami yan sa mga beach. Sandy siya eh. Loam soil. Humus. So, syempre ito oh. Most plants are plant in humus type no soil. So, yan. Thank you. Have a great day and God bless. So, click the thumbs up button if you like this video. And leave a comment down below if you have suggestions, clarifications, and questions in our video. So, thank you. Have a great day and God bless you in my next video. Bye-bye.